Interesting. Got ourselves a package here. And it says Acura. Yeah. Trailer hitch plugs. Lifetime warranty. Quite interesting. Quite interesting. Ooh. I like that. That's got some it's got some weight to it. Doesn't feel like, you know, like thin piece of plastic it doesn't feel like that so this is a 2017 Acura MDX I believe it's the technology package because of the wheels and of course it's got the technology features SH all-wheel drive and this is the cover here Need some, uh, I definitely need some paint. I don't know if this is aftermarket or if this is stock. Let's take a look, see what she looks like. Hmm. Let's see, is there an easy way to open this box? Let me find out. So, usually, when you got one side, you can just whip everything else off. Hmm. A little extra tape over there. Try to pop this side up. There we go. Got one side. This little thing's got some weight to it. On eBay, it said that it's blue. So I was afraid that this cold chrome portion would be blue. But no, it's, it's actually this. It's hard to really tell that it's blue but it's blue I don't think she's really going to notice that it's blue we just need to get one of the pin hitch pin to put in there that's what I totally forgot but uh, let's go ahead and see if I can pop this bad boy open it's interesting that it says Acura on here like there's a sticker that says Acker. So I'm wondering if this is truly a OEM. This thing is a beauty, man. I mean, on camera it doesn't really do justice, but um this thing is it's got some weight to it. It's not as thin as it looks on camera. Uh it's solid like I'm I'm pinching down on this thing Ugh. Ugh. I can't bend it man let me try with my fist Ugh. Ugh. I can't bend this daggone thing man this thing is solid man it is solid but I'm I'm, I'm definitely being careful too because it's sharp it is definitely sharp you got like some sharp sharp corners um, let me see in there up here is some sharp sharp spots so definitely be careful uh, but the thing that, see, that's what I was looking at. Acura, officially licensed product. And that's what really amazed me. You can see in here, it looks like some spot welds. Um, and it's definitely clamped down. So I'm wondering if this is the, like truly an uh, OEM, you know, aftermarket part. You know, the type of parts that you go to Acura dealership. They will have at the parts counter things, additional add-ons that you can buy for your vehicle. Uh, this appears to be, it's legit. Just just look at this logo too, man. This is beautiful. Yeah, they were sold out on the black one. And then they had another one that was, uh, it had a black background, but the emblem, uh, the Acra emblem was gold. Uh, and she has all chrome on her vehicle so having a uh, gold emblem uh, would not match pretty much slides in there you put your uh, tow hitch pin in here so it would basically slide it in line it up okay line it up 
and just put our pin through there and bam I like it I like it honestly believe that she's gonna notice that it's blue though so more than likely she's gonna say I want it black <laughs> Yeah, she wanted a cover. She didn't like it to just be like that. She did not like that. Other people may, you may say, ah, oh, it's fine as it is. But, um, you know, everybody's got their own touchings that they like on their vehicle. You know, some people like the stock. Some people like aftermarket. You know, that's the beauty of it. It's the absolute beauty of it. But, um. Run in my garage and see if I can find that pin. I got one, but it may be a different color, but we'll see. I need to find my actual, because I got like a spare hitch pin that I tossed around, and I believe it's right here. I believe it's right here or it's over there. I'm going to see if I can find, because I know I had a spare one. It, 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 it definitely do got it. So here's the pin right here. More than likely, I'm going to have to buy another one. And the reason being is because... Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, here we go. So she might work, she might, she might let that slide. She might let that one slide. So we'll see. Let's go find out. All right, so we found a spare pin in the garage. That's pretty much what we're looking at. So this would pretty much go through here like that and then that pin will go through there. So let's go ahead and get this installed. So I'm just gonna slide her in. I'm gonna take our pin. Slide that through there. Okay. Basically, slip right through there. So now we just need to take our little cotter pin and put it in there. More than likely, gonna have to do it this way. and stuff but I don't really think that's gonna be noticeable so I think she'll be fine I think she'll be fine kind of show you guys the little angles here a little over the top so that way you guys can see it and over there it just goes perfect with that chrome that chrome finish just look at that that's gorgeous Look at that, man. That is absolutely gorgeous. You can't tell me that's not gorgeous. Later, I'm going to get to uh, clean the hitch up so that way we can kind of get rid of that surface rust and throw a clear coat on it and see how she does. But, you know, we'll get to it when we get to it. So hopefully, guys, you enjoyed this video. Um, Definitely did enjoy getting this bad boy installed, and that just looks so clean. It just looks so clean, just having a hitch thing, having a pin down. Man, that just looks so clean. I was quite shocked. I was absolutely quite shocked because I, I, I thought that this was just going to be like some cheap plastic, you know, but it's not. It is not no cheap thin plastic. That is legit. That is a legit hitch cover. Alright guys, as always, if you found this video review to be helpful to you, please leave a like, comment, and don't forget to subscribe, man. I definitely appreciate your support. 
definitely got plan for some more uh, videos of the Acura DX. Just gotta find some more things to pretty much uh, purchase. <laughs> uh, to be exact. Alright guys, that's it. Peace.